Hey, good day everyone. Welcome back to the channel. This is the Daily Dose and welcome back to our wonderful hobby. Yeah, how is everyone doing? And yeah, for today's episode, uh, we'll be talking about some new mainline Hot Wheels and also some exclusive cars from them. And then we'll be checking out uh, two beautiful cars also from Tarmac Works and also, by the way, updates of course for the 2022 matchbox car so if you like cars if you like die cast cars in particular and uh, if you want to know the latest news from the die cast world please subscribe to the channel and again that is once again the daily dose you can search for my videos here on YouTube by just uh, typing daily dose hot wheels so let's start today's news right now with this update of the upcoming Range Rover Classic thanks to W Smart Diecast for the photo by the way so this is new for 2021 and uh, once again an outstanding new car from them and Hot Wheels man they're just making uh, outstanding new cars so far and this will be part of the Hot Wheels Hot Truck set I just love the colorway on this one like the black the red combination just looks fantastic yeah even the white one right here and the three colorways right here or three colors uh, in this theme just looks absolutely uh, fantastic for the Range Rover Classic the, love the wheels also for this it does have side mirrors as you see so overall fantastic uh, Range Rover Classic right here and then we got another recolor of the Chevy Silverado off-road again typical good stuff although i'm not really a big fan of this colorway for the chevy silverado off-road i kind of like dark colors for this truck but anyway still a still a fantastic casting right here and then check this one out the aston martin v12 speedster to be honest i got no clue about this car i'm talking about the real real life aston martin v12 speedster and uh yeah what the hell it looks good on the 164 scale doesn't have like windshield right so that is kind of weird i could not imagine someone driving this one at high speed without the windshield but can can someone uh please like educate more <laughs> on me about this car so again leave a comment down below i'm really happy to interact with you guys this will be part of the hot wheels exotic set and then uh yeah an update right here of the matchbox 2022 cars we've got some uh moving parts cars right here thanks to see versma 63 this is the ambulance so this is the moving part for this one so pretty cool stuff right here and then the subaru brat which is i think probably one of the best uh moving parts from them so far for next year looks good love the color combination the tempo looks good yes yeah, it looks vintage because of course this is an old car yeah the tempo just suits the car right here got opening parts for this you can see the engine and again i've talked about this one i mean this uh subaru brat uh, in our older videos i think this is like one of the weirdest cars for me because the engine and the reserve tires is close to each other so i don't know how that translates to like real life i don't know if the if the tires will be uh, affected by that because yeah the engine's pretty hot i can't imagine the tires will hold on for a long time in here but again guys leave a comment down below uh, your thoughts about this this subaru brand then uh oh yeah at the back right here i didn't notice this we see a lamborghini also right there so that is really nice another lambo for matchbox then an update on the ford crown victoria taxi right here nyc taxi that's opening doors and i think you can open all four doors in here because i can see like the like some gaps in here but again i'm not really quite sure i'm 50 50 on that and you guys can leave a comment down below oh probably not because you see right here the line 
the rear well on the front front doors yeah you can't find the line in here it's supposed to be in here but for the front door the line is lower so I take my word back I think the front doors don't open so just the rear doors for this one kind of suck I wish they added like I mean all the doors right here you can open that one so anyway still a fantastic uh, NYC taxi right here Ford Crown Vic taxi looks really really cool and yeah matchbox man they got amazing uh, moving parts set next year and also check this one out thanks to rob matchbox 117 for this this is an absolutely fantastic looking porsche i myself i'm a big fan of porsches i do collect porsches although again i'm not a completionist because it's impossible basically uh for me to complete all the lines due to like how hard some of the cars are to find and how expensive they are but this one right here this is like a matchbox dealer model uh 1980 porsche 911 turbo uh yeah this was from the latest matchbox gathering i think that's how they named it and yeah pretty good stuff right here a sneak peek of that car and there you go check that one out that's awesome again dealer model from the matchbox 19th annual collector's convention that's really nice man i love the color on this 911 porsche look at that pretty awesome so got lots of details right here again look at the details at the back tons of it all the uh, areas which are supposed to be detailed are detailed so that is fantastic and up front again beautiful detailing also man uh, yeah i just love the this tone of green man this is just beautiful and then yeah of course another premium car right here this is again an exclusive one uh exclusive divco truck looks really nice Look at this. Thanks to uh, C Wormsma for the photo, by the way. The paint finish is just outstanding. Just superb detailing, man. Big fan of the Divco uh, truck, man. And this one is just fantastic. Look at that. Absolutely stunning. Again, these two premium ones come in this like acrylic display uh, case. So that's just adds more to the premiumness of it yeah, look at that pretty awesome and also right here we got the uh, latest action drivers play set or diorama set includes the 2016 chevy camaro convertible and this matchbox private jet pretty fun play set right here got two ramps right there pretty nice you can fit in a lot of cars a lot of airplanes also in that so this one has like car activated lights and sound so that's pretty nice look at the plane and the camera convertible right there that's pretty nice i think this one was available in single uh, i kind of forgot but they can correct me leave a comment down below so you can see the features right here you can pause this one if you like that is really really nice right there and then yeah from tarmac works check out their uh, two uh, new pagani zonda so we got the pagani zonda revolution and the pagani zonda r so both pretty similar looking but they do have some minor differences and you guys leave a comment down below uh, the differences that you can spot between uh, both of them so look at that I can see like the logo right here the they have the same wheel set but I think the uh, Zonda revolution is uh, like has a darker rim set I don't know man maybe it's just because of the light right here yeah, different tampos right here on the spoiler also on the like the windshield that's yeah, different slight slightly different 
R logo at the top for the Zonda R. Also, like right here, you can see like a green one. This one's different. And uh, what else? On the rear, yeah. This one right here has the lights painted. Yeah, you can see that one yellow. Different logos in here. What else? Yeah, this one also. I don't know. <laughs> I I really don't know exactly what the name of these parts are. So, <laughs> pardon me, guys. Yeah, this one right here. You can't find it in like the uh, Revolution. And some more photos of the Pagani Zonda R. Thanks to Future Diecast Bros for this. Yeah, look at that. Look at how premium this one looks. Even the interior is absolutely well detailed. And by the looks of it, again, opening parts, movable parts for this. Pretty nice. Damn, this is so cool. Yeah, look at that. That is just an awesome release right here from Tarmac Works. Man, <laughs> yeah, so that will be all for our news and showcase for today. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, again, subscribe to the channel, smash that like button, click the bell icon so you won't miss our daily uploads. And I'll be seeing you on our next episode. Bye bye, guys. Have a great day. Thank you, everyone, for watching. I appreciate it a lot. So, anyways, again, see you tomorrow. Have a great day, guys.